I remember when I was about 9 to 10 years old, my mother bought for me a few colorful, exciting books about the emerging technologies of computing and space travel. I remember in those days uh, when I was reading about the exploits of NASA in the US, it was very exciting times and I actually dreamt at that time of going to the US and working for NASA. Of course that never happened but the excitement of uh, what NASA was doing was what motivated me to take up a career in science and engineering. How long can we depend upon foreign technology in our country? While many of our institutions are doing excellent work at the frontiers of science and technology, they need to also communicate to society in a simple way what they are doing. In addition to being ivory towers, our institutions need to become lighthouses of information and knowledge, attracting the youth to the portals to participate in the joys of discovery and innovation. It is very important to understand that writing programs or building implementations based upon somebody else's design is quite straightforward. Such is the influence of widespread dissemination of the discoveries and innovations that scientists and engineers do on the young mind. What our country really needs is for uh, our youth to get involved in the wonders and in the practical importance of research and development because only then can our country grow. I would like to wish the very best for the Chandrayaan mission from my personal self and from the Indian Institute of Science.